Welcome to Wealth Plan TV. We're starting the second series and we're just reviewing GoDare. You'll remember that GoDare is goals, outs and ins, which is cash flow, accumulation, risk, and estate planning. You know that each, each week in the series, we go through this mnemonic. So on the first series, we went through those six issues twice, and in the second series, we'll do the same. G stands for goals. If you want to achieve useful things in life, you must have goals. If you don't have goals, then you'll end up probably somewhere else, which I guess is another way of saying that if you don't have goals, you'll get there every time, but you just don't know where. So if you want to achieve useful things in life, you have to know where you're going, and not only that, your goals actually have to be written and understood. If you don't achieve your goal, it's only because there is a clearer path to a lesser goal. What you need to do is you need to focus on your premium goal to the exclusion of everything else, particularly if you want to enjoy the nicer things in life. The O of GoDare is for outs and ins, which is really cash flow management. If your idea of cash flow management is the tab, we are in deep trouble. Cash flow management and debt are pretty tight, they run together. So, to gain good cash flow, you have to control debt, but there's some incredibly good cash flow habits you can develop. And we're hoping to run through the series a keys to cash flow management segment like we did with Fred and John in the, in the first series. O is for cash flow. The D of GoDare is for debt. Debt is incredibly important to control. It's something we all experience. We've all got credit cards, we've probably all got home loans, or if we haven't, we aspire to them. The control of debt is really the key to creating financial wealth, I believe. So we have focused already on types of debt and types of home loan. We'll be looking at this series of going more further into how debt might be understood and controlled. A is for accumulation. Accumulation is anything that allows you to, to hold and grow money. Property, shares, bonds, derivatives, anything that allows you to store wealth. Understanding all the different uh, products and how they can be used to create wealth is a very important element in creating wealth, and we'll be spending more time in this area. A is for accumulation. R is for risk. As you know, risk describes any type of personal insurance. In the first series, we've discussed the difference between life insurance, total and permanent disability insurance, trauma insurance, and income protection. The issue is that if something happens to you and you end up somewhere like here, you'll want to make sure that your family is looked after. From our earlier definition, we know that what we're trying to do is create forward days. And if you've been hit by a flaming oil truck before you've created enough forward days for your family, you need to buy some. The only place you can buy forward days is with insurance. R is for risk. The E of GoDare is for estate planning. Estate planning is a matter of getting your affairs in order before you decease and in managing the estate afterwards. So if you want to avoid the court system, which is a good idea, the best thing to do is to spend time to make sure your estate is right. The time that you spend in ordering your affairs alive has a, a number of benefits. It means you understand your affairs more simply, but it means that if you are knocked off the perch, the people who follow you have got a chance of understanding them as well. Of course, wills and powers of attorney direct people to do things that you wanted upon your death, so they're important too.